Let's check out the four best WordPress podcast plugins. Number one, Blueberry PowerPress. A major benefit to using PowerPress is the built-in SEO settings. It sets up your podcast posts in the same way that plugins like Rank Math and Yoast SEO do for your typical posts. It will handle your schema and adjust your RSS feed prefixes and episode metadata. Whether you use audio or video to deliver your podcast, this plugin has you covered. With their audio options, you could choose between a plain, no-frills player or a robust, rich player that lets users see your show notes, download the episode, or even subscribe through various services. In terms of video, whether you host the video locally, on your Blueberry account, or even on YouTube, you can use their dedicated player to get your content out. And it's free to use. We have an entire blog post dedicated on how to set up your podcast with Blueberry PowerPress. Number two, Fusebox Podcast Player. The best feature about using the plugin is the enormous amount of customization that you get, even in the free version. You can choose brand colors, the episode artwork, whether or not the listeners can download the episode, share it, or subscribe. You even get to choose if your listeners can speed up their listening. The free version of the plugin allows for up to 10,000 listens for up to three different shows. The premium upgrade starts at $15 per month billed annually. Number three. Seriously Simple Podcasting. This free plugin features multiple extensions and add-ons. Users can access transcripts and statistics for the service with just a few clicks. Plus, you can set up different hosts for different posts. We also have a full rundown of this plugin if you're interested in seeing a more in-depth look at how it works. And finally, number four, Podlove. The free Podlove Publisher plugin is what you use to get your audio or video into your users' feeds. It comes bundled with the Web Player plugin, which is a clean and lightweight HTML5 player. Podlove offers a great deal of customization options. You can configure items like combining your blog and podcast feeds. You can set podcast landing pages and decide on a permalink structure for your episodes. On top of all that, the Web Player is compatible with the Gutenberg block editor. And there you go. Those were the four best podcast plugins for WordPress. If you enjoyed this video, then be sure to give it a like and subscribe for more content. With that said, thanks for watching and we'll catch you in the next one.